There is a classically distributed computing scenario called the Byzantine Generals Problem. It describes a problem in consensus making and a system where everything can break down if communication channels are not trustworthy. The main idea with this Byzantine's general problem is that a group of generals band together to attack a city. If they all work together successfully, they will win. If one or more of them back out, change sides, or don't show up at the right time, the attack will fail. The generals don't necessarily trust each other or their communication channels, but they must come to a consensus on whether to attack together and they must execute their attack at the same time to win. The generals of the armies need to rely on the messengers and that they are being truthful and also need to rely on one another's word. This is a concept that is used to describe a situation in which a distributed computer system will catastrophically fail if the system's actors are not working together in a strategic way. Blockchain is a great solution to the Byzantine generals problem. Each participant on the network can be thought of as a node in the system. Nodes all communicate with one another and are constantly expanding as more activity is happening. Messages can be thought of as transactions. There are constant transactions and activities between nodes and also opportunities for things to go wrong if there are bad actors who want to alter the state of transactions or be malicious in some way. The enemy city can be thought of as any man in the middle who seeks to alter the blockchain or do something else as a bad actor. Blockchain networks are built with predefined rules about what can happen, when it can happen, and how it happens. This makes transactions more predictable and dependable and creates a network of participants that must work together at all times. Blockchain systems are successful because trust is built into the system.